What if I told you that? You can create mind-blowing motion graphics like these without touching After Effects, Premiere Pro, or have any animation skill. In today's video, I'm going to show you step-by-step step how to create viral motion graphics in Canva. First, let's start with this simple animation. Now sit back relax and grab a cup of coffee because in this five minutes you are going to learn a lot. First create a new project. Then I will select social media then Instagram post. Our blank canvas is ready. First I will change the background color to black. Then go to elements tab to search for the object. Search meditation. Now click on this three dot then filter animated only. In this way you will only see animated objects. Among then let me select this. As you can see it's nicely animated. Now search for similar object. You can always drag the edges to adjust its position. Here is a pro tip. You can click on the three dot and go to its creator page to find similar object. Now let's use this one which I have used in the beginning of my video. Now to make it professional let's add some text. Press T on your keyboard. And write some motivational quotes. Make sure you highlight some of the letters. Now similarly I will do this for other two of my design. Now let's move on to our next animation. To make this animation, go to Element tab and search for Stick Person. Now to Graphics tab. And like we did in previous example, Click on this three dot and filter animated only. As you can see, there are only animated characters. From here, select this running man. Adjust its position. Here is a neat trick to make your character run from one side to other. Click on this animate button. Then this B icon. Now drag your character from one side to other. Select movement style to smooth or steady. And you have a running man character. Search for similar character for your story. I will use three characters so let's use this one as well. Press L to get this line. And adjust its thickness. Now here is an optional thing you can do. You can search for gridline technology. And using your design so it looks unique. You can further reduce its transparency like this. Now add motivational text to your design. And highlight one letter. Similarly, I will do it for other to design as well. Finally, for our last design, we will be designing this after effect motion. But we will be using help of CapCut to design this. First, we will design in Canva. Search for bouncing ball and select this one. Now click on this icon to crop this image. Just crop the button part only. Make sure the ball bouncing on the ground is visible. It should look something like this. Press C to bring text box. Write your text. Similarly, bring another text box and write your text. After writing your text, right-click to duplicate the page. Now click on Effect tab. And select Hello Effect. Again duplicate the page. Remove the effect on first text then input Hello Effect on your next text. You might be confused but after watching this step 3 or 4 times it will be clear. Now download this files as we will be animating in CapCut. Make sure you download it as separate files. Now bring the downloaded files to CapCut. 
Don't worry if you have not used CapCut before as I will show you in details. We will bring our files in timeline. Simply drag and drop it like this. Now for the ball animation place it above the text. But as you can see our background is not visible so we need to overlay it. Go to blend and select this option brighten. One final step. We need to make this ball bounce as if it is changing the text color. We need to make it bounce like this. And text color should be also changed. To do that we need to input keyframe in between. But first identify the ball bouncing position. Then click on this position keyframe. Now bring the ball to the text as if it is bouncing and keyframes will be drawn automatically. We need exactly where the ball will land. This is the exact position we need. Bring it on top. Then click on this position keyframe. Now again select when the ball will land. And move it to other text. Now move it as if it is leaving the screen. And you should have something like this. Now what you want to do is whenever the ball is hitting the letter you want to change its color. As we have already made it in Canva now we simply need to split the scene. To do that, click on this icon to remove the right side only. Let me quickly reverse the position as I have alternatively kept it. Nice this is the actual position of the text. Now again when the ball touches another letter split the scene. I have made a detailed video on this topic if you want to learn this in detail. Now you have a professional looking animation. Make necessary adjustment. And there you have it guys hope you learned something from this video. You can check my other animation related videos from here.